Washington State produces some of the highest quality turf grass seed in the world. It is now late August and it's time to plant. We plant in the fall. Our ideal planting time for Kentucky bluegrass in this area is late August. This will give it enough time to get some good growth on it. We'll get a couple inches of growth here this fall and it'll go into spring a strong, healthy plant. Then we are able to grow through spring and by late June, early July, we'll have enough seed heads and it'll start to dry out and that's when the seed is formed and that's when we come in and harvest. We're planting the same seed in the field here today that you plant in your yard. The seed is a very small seed and there's about 1.8 million seeds of bluegrass per pound and we're planting about five pounds of seed per acre today. Versus when you're planting in your lawn, you're planting about three pounds per thousand square feet. We know that we have a short window for planting bluegrass and so we are working hard to make that transition. Right now we have multiple tractors in the field. One tractor is going across and tilling the soil while the tractor right behind it is then planting the seed for the next crop. We are putting our seed into our double disc drill. That is then funneling down through the disc and we're planting about a quarter to an eighth inch deep just under the soil surface. At that point we're keeping the moisture right at the soil level until the seed germinates. This is very similar to what we're doing in your own lawn when you're planting it at home. We're wanting to plant it very shallow and then keep the water at a level where the seed stays moist and does not dry out during the germination process. We have a lot of privileges here in the Columbia Basin and one of those is being able to have water when we need it. So it's very important for this grass, especially this time of year. Today we're getting close to 90 degrees outside and we're planting into a very dry climate. But we're able to put water on this as, as soon as we plant it. That's very important to growing the crop. As soon as we plant this, we'll keep the water running on this field all the way through the germination process. If there's ever a gap in there where the seed dries out, that could kill anything from happening and we will not get that seed to sprout. So it's very important that we hold the moisture all through the germination process. Grass is good, and your green lawn starts right here. <laughs>